Hello, I'm Greg McQuaid. Here are the top stories that we are following for you today on CBS 6. Chesterfield County Police investigating a shooting death of an Amazon delivery service partner driver. That is according to Crime Insider sources. Sources tell John Burkett the shooting happened at an Amazon warehouse about 930 last night in the 1600 block of Bellwood Road. Sources also say a worker followed a trail of blood outside the building where they heard a gunshot. A female driver was later found with a gunshot wound and pronounced dead. Anyone with information is asked to call Chesterfield County Police. In Richmond, police are investigating a double shooting that injured two people. Police say it happened about 640 Friday evening along the 1500 block of Idlewood Avenue, right near the Randolph Community Center. Crime Insider sources say that the shooting stemmed from an argument at the Community Center pool. Officials say the victims, an adult and a minor, suffered non-life-threatening injuries. Hello, Michael. Hey, Greg. Well, this morning we dropped down to the mid 40s and some of our cooler outlying areas felt like fall this morning officially went down to 52 at the airport, but 44 in Louisa, Farmville and Emporia and went down to 40 in Stanton. High state rebound though, upper 70s and low 80s, still low levels of humidity tonight, a little bit warmer, about 55 to 60 away from the coast and tomorrow pretty similar upper 70s and low 80s. Sunshine today mixed with some high clouds coming in from the west. Those high clouds will increase and thicken tonight into the day. Sunday there will be chance for a few scattered showers and thunderstorms tomorrow. First part of the day, the best chance is going to be out by I-81. A couple of those may get into the metro by late in the afternoon into the evening. These will be scattered, so not everyone will see them. And then the chance of rain will go up a little bit more into Monday. But again, this is still just some scattered thunderstorm activity. A lot more humid Monday, Tuesday into Wednesday. A low chance of rain Tuesday, but then it pops back up Wednesday into Thursday. It looks like Thursday may be our best chance of seeing some rain and storms this week. Then that system gets out of here early Friday. It'll turn less humid Friday afternoon.